Okay. Um, I apologize. There is no intro today. Well, there is right now, but there was none, you know, walking to the gym or in the car. I just didn't feel like doing it in the car, and then I, I couldn't get it right walking to the gym. I just kept stuffing up. So we'll do it here. Um, it's push today. You can probably tell because I'm on the chest machine. So chest and tricep. There'll be no overhead tricep extensions, as I think leaning back with a heavy weight stuff up that little bit of pain I have down near my leg and back, lower back. Um, the quote today, though, there is a difference only you can make. That is from Barbie and the Twelve Princesses. My partner helped me pick this quote. It's still a very good quote, even if it comes from a little kitty girl movie. Um, you have to think there is a difference that only you can make, and especially in your own life, you know. You control that. Only you can change your own life. Yeah, you can get help from the outside world. No one's saying you can't. But if you're not willing to change as well or make a difference in your own life, it will never happen. So, yeah, that's all I had to say. And that's all I couldn't say or get right in what was meant to be the intro. So now that's done, we'll get this done. There's no drop set here. So we'll get the only sets that are here completed. Now, I don't think I've set this up fully yet, but we'll have a see. No, it should be good right now. Oh. That was nice. Two more. Oh, okay. Know how I wanted to end it? But how it ended anyways. I'll catch my breath. And then I will re-rack this. Probably the safe way. So yeah, I'll do it the safe way. Actually, I'll just squeeze out. Picture if you were, you know, really muscly. Or really fat. You wouldn't be able to sit out like this. You'd have to push it back up or get someone's help. I can count my blessings to being thin for the time being. I don't want to be thin forever. Um, pet deck fly time. Three sets here and the drop set. Let's get it done. Um, one, two, look. That's better. <laughs> Oh. 
Okay, that done. Let's move on to the last chest exercise, which will be, uh, I believe it's called incline chest press machine. I'll see that everything up. Yeah, everything is set up, ready to go. Let's just smash these out, finish chest up once and for all. <sighs> I love this machine. I love this one a lot more than I like the regular chest press. Two more, hopefully just like that. Oh, and the drop set. <laughs> Last set <clears throat> and the drop set. <laughs> Oh, the chest workout and that like chest pumped feeling, it's always so nice. I don't know if it's the best feeling when you have your sore quads and hamstrings from a leg day. That feels amazing. But chest is up there. It's like, I'll say it's number two. Legs is first. Okay, enough of a rating scale. Let's get back to the workout. Um, tricep time. Tricep push downs. I see with that machine. Uh, three sets here, 12 reps, and the drop set. Oh, 
Oh my god. Nothing ties out my triceps quite like some push downs. Get that away from me. Either way, I've only got one more tricep workout to do, which will be tricep dips, as I've already mentioned. I'm not doing some overhead, so let's head over there now. Okay, <clears throat> last tricep exercise. Um, yeah, let's get it done. I think I said exercise, not exercise. It sounded weird, so I had to correct it. And if it didn't sound weird, well, now you can hear me say that weird word. Okay, that done. That means triceps are done. Um, now we can move on to the shoulders and the abs. Shoulders are going to be some rear delts. So I'll see you back on the pec deck machine. So normally I avoid this pec deck machine to do rear delts on. Cause someone's bit the seat and there's like an indent of that. But the other one's got the same thing. So I have a... To me, I'm not no forensic scientist, but the bite mark and pattern looks identical. So maybe it's the same person. Either way, if you are watching this video with that person, you're disgusting. I hope you know that. There's no other way to put it. I'm not here to be nice. You are disgusting. Either way, three sets here that I filmed. There's five altogether. Let's get into them. <coughs> Okay, two more for me to do off camera. Once those are done, I'll see you over on the ab crunch machine. Okay, shoulders done. Ab time, three sets, 30 reps each. I film one of them, we'll get that one done. Hopefully my hat this way doesn't mess up the workout, but I don't want to change it now because I'd have to move the mic and all this crap.
Oh, that's always nice. Two more for me to do, but for you guys, I'll see you on the way or in the car. Let's try and make it in the car this time. Well, I didn't lie, but I didn't make it to the car either. We're doing another outro on the walk to the car. I did my cardio, my shins start to fire up. I think I was going that hard, so I had to pause. You're always allowed to pause. You're always allowed to take a break. Catch your breath, which I didn't do. <laughs> Catch your breath, jump right back onto it. And if it's bike, rowing machine, stairs, treadmill, or anything outdoors, you know, actually running around, you know, a circuit or something. You know, that would be, that's even better, but I don't do that. I like my treadmill. I did do cardio on the bike first, but I found that more hard so the treadmill it gets tiring but I can get to a hundred calories where I can get to my my minutes with such an intense incline and um what's it called speed rate I don't know what it is so yeah <clears throat> as I said though the calories are not my goal it is the minutes but normally back on the bike they like came in tangent so I would start at 10 minutes and progress but 10 minutes would normally make me get 100 calories now on the treadmill with the incline that I'm doing I get 10 minutes and like I mean 100 calories in five minutes so again not basing it off the calories but I know the treadmill was pushing me harder if I can get to that sooner but yeah um, should be legs tomorrow but my back is sore, I don't know if I'll do it. I don't know if there will be a video. You have to be smart sometimes, you have to know when enough is enough. So with that, it's been a good workout. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. If you're sore, maybe consider staying home and recovering. If you're not, head to that gym, head to your football field, wherever you work out, and work out your damnedest. I believe in you. Hope you have a great weekend if I don't see you tomorrow. That's all. Peace.